Hey guys, it's Jack and welcome back to another video and I'm in London today uh, for a couple of days just having a bit of a trip and I've just had my breakfast, it's very nice and now I'm going to go off and uh, have a bit of a day out in London so if you fancy joining me um, I don't actually know what I've got planned for today um, I've got a few errands I need to run which will be coming up in other videos but I um, might be going to a show tonight Might that's where I'm heading now over to see if I can get some cheap tickets for tonight and yeah, fingers crossed. It's also a bit of a rainy day today, so not looking forward to that. And there's the Tower of London. Very exciting. I thought I'd take the Boat down the uh, Thames to that to get to where I'm going. It's not like one stop, but I'm gonna just walk down to the pier now that's near where I'm staying. Uh, and so, yeah, probably there in about a couple of minutes. So, quick update. Uh, I'm probably not going to be going to the theatre tonight. Just been to have a look at some of the, these are the cheap option tickets that they do, like, you know, discounted rates the day off. And they were starting at like 60, 70 quid. So, and that's for like a couple of different shows that I checked. So, not half, not definitely not going to be doing that tonight. They were 42, ticket, 42 quid yesterday. And I didn't fancy it then. So, I might just leave it. Although, I have, I have remembered that I'm meeting James later, who you who may or may not have met. He's a friend of mine lives in London. He is doing a concert like yesterday. So I said I'll go and see him. So it's been a couple of hours since I last spoke to you all. And I've got a quick update, uh, which is I Basically, after the concert, I went for a few drinks with James and a few of his mates, had a good time. Had a couple of uh, beers in the pub. To work out, sorry, I can't remember where to go. And I changed my mind about theatre tickets, and I wasn't paying 50 quid, 60 quid for them, so I had a look on the actual theatre show's website. And I've managed to get some for, like, odd pounds which was about the same price that I've been paying yesterday, but I got, which I did think was a bit ridiculous yesterday, but... I have decided today is worth it for some reason. It is Friday. Some of the tickets overpriced me were like a hundred quid. Please so, mind the doors. Doors closing. So I'm literally on my way down there now. And then going just, down. Got to get some food, and uh, then I'll go and watch the theatre show. I probably won't be able to go to the actual four. show itself, but anyway. So, I don't know if I've said yet, but uh, I'm watching the play that goes wrong tonight. I'm, I, like, this whole day feels like it's been recorded in about 48 hours or something. So, no idea. But if I haven't mentioned already, I'd like to go and see. Uh, I'm watching the play that goes wrong tonight. Uh, I've seen this before, but uh, when it was touring, I think it was either pre COVID or just after COVID. Um, certainly not for a while. And I love, the, I love all the stuff these guys do. Uh, I have books for me and my dad to go and watch. Um, Another one of their shows, a, from, from when I'm recording this, from a couple of weeks. Um, so I'm recording this at the start of March, and um, at Easter, we're going watching uh, Peter Panda that goes, Peter Panda goes wrong as well. But I, I don't know, I've seen all their shows before. The first time I came to London properly, um, oh, sorry, second time, last time I came to London properly, uh, I saw Comedy About Bank Robbery, which is another one of those, but I'm looking forward to this tonight. Sorry, we just came to it. So, that was my day in London. But for now, I think it's time to say goodnight.